Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to sync two separate Google Drive accounts to one computer using the Google Drive desktop client. And you could actually do this for up to three accounts at a time. So this way if you have two separate users and you want to keep everything synchronized and not have to switch back and forth between accounts or go to the website for each one, you could do this uh, method here. So we have uh, Cindy's Google Drive account here. And then we have Todd's Google Drive account here. So the first thing we need to do is install the client. So you can do that from the settings, get Drive for Desktop, download Drive for Desktop, and then just run the installation. Then you can have put a shortcut to your desktop if you want. You can have shortcuts for Google Docs, Sheets, and Slides. I'll skip that. Okay, so now we're going to sign in with one of the accounts here. Start with Todd. Okay, so now we have Google Drive open here. Let's close that out. Let's go to our icon. So it's syncing the files right now. Okay, so you can see we have our Google Drive icon here. And we also have a Google Drive icon here, our G Drive. So we have the classroom invoices pictures. This should match what we have from Todd here. Classroom invoices pictures. Okay, so we have Todd all synced up and ready to go on the G drive. Okay, so now we're going to open the drive client from the system tray down here. Just right click on it. Click on your account here. Make sure you click on your account, not on the settings. Click on your actual account name and click Add Another Account. Now we're going to sign in with Cindy here. Okay, that's done there. So now Google Drive is loading the files for Cindy. Okay, so now you can see we have our main account for Todd here. My Drive, with the classroom pictures and invoices and so on. And then we have the Cindy account here for Google Drive, My Drive, Dog Sales Files website, which matches here. So now you can see you have uh, two different drive letters, one for each Google Drive account. And then that way when you make changes, you can make them here from the website and then they should sync up with each other. And then you can do what you need to do for each account from uh, one location. So once again, just go to each account or actually go to one of the accounts, download the client, sign in. And then once the uh, client's installed and signed in, right-click it from the system tray, click on the user, and then click on Add Another User, and then you can take it from there. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.